Hi everyone, it's the English Swimmer here and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Late Night Part 16 and I just quickly want to point out Carmen's face. Look at that face. She's like, I'm a young adult. I just had a baby with a five star celebrity. This child that I am holding right here in my arms is Matthew Hamming's son. How the heck did that happen? I was just a little country girl who moved to the city to live with my cousin and now I have a baby with the most famous man in Bridgeport and she looks terrified, bless her. She looks like she has no clue what she's about to do. She doesn't know what to do with a baby. But yeah, um, last time we, set, we left off, um, Carmen and Matthew had had little Tobias over here and he is pretty hungry so we're gonna head home and feed him and all that good stuff. Matthew you need to go to the toilet. He wants to snuggle Tobias, how cute. I actually need to get these two ready for work. This is actually my second time recording this part because the first part, Fraps didn't want to um, work with me and froze and I completely lost everything. So here we go again. Um, April is reading a book. What is this? I've never seen April read. This is not the April we know. What is happening right now? Anyway, April, you need to eat some leftover waffles. Oliver, you can shower. Go to the toilet and shower up, my friend, because you both have work today. And then you can have some plasma juice after you have finished that. Come on, Carmen. Ray, just come home. Um. So yeah, in this part, I am hopefully going to have April end it with Mr. Tom because I have decided who I want her to be in a relationship with and we as she is a two star celebrity right now she actually has to break up with Tom before word gets around that she has a bad reputation where is poor Tobias where is this child he's still in his her arms are you still what don't answer your phone Matthew can you quickly come upstairs please Matthew come upstairs you need to go to the toilet go and use the toilet quick and where are you okay you're she's like why am I holding this shot what is up Carmen Fix your face right now. Carmen. Okay, is she back to normal? She's like, ugh, you just gave me this screaming baby. She hates Matthew right now. <laughs> she has a screaming baby in her arms and is giving him the death glare. You go here while Matthew takes a wee. Actually, you can come and make the beds. Be useful once, April. Oliver, where's your guitar? I swear we put it down. Why don't you play alone? You need to feed this child. Give him a bottle. Such a bad mum. And Matthew. Matthew, you have some leftover waffles and you can get a shower before you head to work and use that. Tobias, can you please be quiet now? What do you want? She's going to slow dance. No! Oliver! Oh, she's actually going to slow dance to his music. I thought they were going to slow dance together. I was like, you just had Matthew's baby. You cannot go with Oliver and just start slow dancing. So 
Oh yeah, um, quickly want to point out, I did Tobias's room. It's kind of like a jungly theme. A little tree over here and his little forest trees and his little giraffe and a toy box. And yeah, it's pretty basic, but he's only a baby and it's quite small, but once again, he is only a baby. He doesn't need that much room. All he's going to be doing is lying in his crib for the next four days three days and yeah so you can actually you need to eat oh she's going to compliment his appearance Matthew you actually nice nice music Oliver nice music she's enthusing about new house how about no how about you just come and watch some TV before you have to head to work Oliver you're really loud Matthew, answer that phone and then you have an opportunity to do. So go cameo in the play. And Carmen, use that, take a shower and eat some leftover waffles. Because you're getting hungry. And then you can because we haven't done that in a while which we kind of should have let's turn that off no one's really listening to it april it might be cold outside but i am gonna have you head over to where your carpool picks you up because you are always late for work like all the time so go here <laughs> i want i don't want you to be late for work well, I don't have any clue why the carpool flipping shows up on the bridge. Like, it's ridiculous. They have to walk pretty much hard before they actually reach their carpool, which means that they are always late for work. She wants to woohoo in an elevator. You've already done that. I think you've pretty much woohooed wherever you could woohoo. So yeah, I'm hoping that Tom answer that phone Oliver I'm hoping that Tom will meet up with us we can just dump him really where are you about to put your guitar please put it away in the normal place where it's meant to go yay good boy he like never does that he normally hides it wherever I can't see it oh it was a he didn't even need to answer it anyway it wasn't important See, she has to get a taxi to where her thingy picks her up. That is ridiculous. Yep, go hang with cast members. And, uh, yeah, that's okay. Carmen, you're washing the dishes. That's fine with me. Oh, he's really, really tired, bless him. They have just had a baby though, so I can imagine why they would both be tired. Tobias came at a really tricky like moment. Aww, oh. Uncle Oliver is gonna play with him. How cute. Aww. How cute is that? Oliver Pensky just picked up Tobias. Yeah, put him in his swing. Are you in work? You're actually heading to work. Oh, uh, what? Why are you running? Did I send you to the complete wrong place? I know. See, the carpool drops them off in a weird place as well. It's crazy. And... Oliver, your thing is here. I'm guessing this is your carpool, so I'm just going to have you teleport here. So yeah, I'm just going to have him teleport there because that saves time for me, if I'm honest. And Carmen's here practicing her drinks once again. She still- She made nice quality drinks! Guys, this is- this is crazy. Carmen actually made nice quality drinks. That never happens. The play was pretentious and barely comprehensible, but the audience loved it. That might have something to do with a certain superstar cameo. 
So Matthew earned 100 celebrity points and 5,000 simoleons. And he's making a snow angel to celebrate. You need to come home and sleep. That's what you need to do. And yeah, Carmen made nice drinks. Guys, this is the first time this has ever happened. Like what? I'm so proud of her. She's not vomiting whenever she makes drinks now. So proud, proud moment. You go, Carmen. You're finally, finally getting better at this skill. She's so cute. I still love her as a sim. Congratulations, Carmen has just improved her mixology skill to level 7. Carmen is probably skilled enough to seek work at some of the higher class establishments in the area. Classier clientele means better tips, but these sims still want better drink quality drinks and sometimes will order a spe specific type of mood drink and get uppity if Carmen can't serve it. She'd better be well practiced in serving a variety of drinks. April has available film work. Go and perform that job. Yep, that's fine. April and 66 million. Is she missing work or does that class as work? That class is as work, so that's fine. She needs to work out for four hours. Is Matthew home? Is our husband, well, husband-to-be. He's technically not our husband yet. Sorry about that, guys. So yeah, he or Matthew wants to go up in his charisma skill, which he actually really needs to do for his work. And how is little Tobias? Oh, he's in his swing. Did we actually set the swing on or did Oliver just put him in there? Look at how cute he is! What a cutie pie. He looks scary right there, but when he was smiling. Look! Oh my goodness. Carmen. Come and turn this on to slow for your little boy and then you can have a nap. You can just sleep. He's so cute. Look at him. He is adorable. I know that all sim babies look exactly the same but they just look so cute when they're first born. He's so happy and smiley. He's a really happy baby. That's what I want. When I have a baby, I want them to be happy babies. I can I cannot deal with grumpy babies. <laughs> I remember when my niece was born and she cried constantly and I was just like, please just be quiet. <laughs> like she was so cute, but my goodness, she cried a lot. So Matthew, your your energy has barely gone up. I probably need to get them a better bed, but I like this bed. So yeah, I'm gonna skip through until the other two are out of work. So guys, Oliver once again just befriends, became friends with Tom. I don't know why that happened, but he has this, the word around town is that Oliver Penske is getting a lot of positive looks from his recent activities. People seem to be whispering Oliver's name. So he is now a level 2 celebrity. Loading up the band's equipment is always a dangerous chore, but sometimes it can be downright dangerous. A careless roadie almost dumped all the guitars out of the back of the bus while loading them. If it wasn't for Oliver's quick action to save the guitars, they could have taken some damage. Oliver got a small cash bonus. So well done, Oliver. And you are not going to come home. You are actually... Oh, Tom's not actually out of work yet. But we are going to go to... I'm pretty sure we've been to most places. Um, let's go to the Brightmoor. Because I'm sure Tom will turn up to the Brightmoor. So yeah, go there. And we can wait for Tom to actually get out of work. He'll be getting out at the same time as Oliver, pretty much. Oliver, you can eat that. And then 
you can also head over to the Brightmoor. You guys might be seeing where this is leading to. <laughs> um, how are your two energies doing? You know what? That's fine. You need to shower because you are stinky. And you, some, you can also clean the toilet while you're at it. Carmen, do you want to make some dinner? How about you serve some veggie rolls? Right now, this place is as hot as Conifrio with a bad case of hypothermia. There must be a more popular spot to party tonight. Well, that's not good. Oliver earned 261 simoleons. They are boasting about gaming skills. Um, I want you to call and invite him out. Maybe invite him. I feel bad inviting him on a date because it's like, oh yeah, hey, want to go on a date? Um, psych, I'm actually dumping you. <laughs> Hopefully he'll say yes because I really need him to say yes. Where is she? Sure, that sounds like fun. Let's meet there. Sweet. How about you change into your formal wear? Oliver, change into your formal wear. Because you are not going into a club looking like that. And go to level B1. And you can just wait. She is excited. She's excited to dump. Tom. Um, how is little Tobias doing? He's fine. He's loving life in this swing. She's watching him. How cute. Let me get a picture. Oops. The, I hate apartments for the fact that they are so small. So when you try and take pictures, they just go crazy. Okay, I'm not going to be able to get a picture of that. Never mind. Um, did you make our food? That sounds so wrong. Woman, did you make our food? <laughs> uh, you can grab a plate. And you can also grab a plate. She wants to mix an energy drink. And she wants to mix a great drink. And she wants to create a new drink. I will be getting them married in the next few parts. I think I'm actually going to have probably Matthew throw a bachelor party and at one of the clubs because he is the highest celebrity. He knows more people and I just think that will be more fun. So we will be throwing that. Ah, Tom is here. Hello, Mr. Wordy. We are going to... Sorry, we're going to hop straight to it and ask you to just be friends. Alan Stanley wants to know if April Thorning would like to go on a date. No, thank you. We have done our dating. We have finished with that side of our lives. April, April is aging up soon and she wants to, she wants to settle down. Where is Mr. Oliver's just dancing. He's going crazy. He wants to have a drink. So, is there a mixologist on? There is. Best food in town. Matthew, it's your agent. Okay. So, we just go and try the food. We can do that at some point. How about you order a... Um... Pink bunny. I don't know what that is. No, we're not letting you into our house. No. Carmen, I just said we weren't letting her into our house. And you just go and do. April, are you breaking up with him? Oh. Let's see how angry he gets. They always get so angry. Just, just friendly. No, try to impress celebrity. Talk about piano. No, try and impress him. Oh, he's leaving. Fine then. April Thorning just became friend. Oh, it's you. No discount for you, buddy. That's because he's been, um, like falsely accused. But he wasn't falsely accused. He was actually he actually bit someone. We can't deny that. 
Somebody in this group has unresolved issues. I think I'll get out of here become the bef before the sa fighting starts. Well, that was somewhat fun. Maybe next time we'll tear it up. Can she still not go in there? She's a two-star celebrity and she still can't flipping make it in this area. Are you kidding me? How dare you? We are a well-known celebrity. Sneak in. Sneak in. Sneak in. While she's not there. Yes. April. Yes. So she has this moodlet that says snuck in. You will you have successfully snuck into the bar, but you will your low profile keep you safe? Of course it will. Oliver. Get your little booty in here, my friend. Sneak in. Well she's not there. She's dancing. So we're gonna go sneak in whilst you are over here dancing. Carmen Rose just kissed celebrity Matthew Hamming. Oh, so they're, they're having a moment. He's drinking the party drink. I love how they're having a quiet evening alone and he just is still drinking party drinks. So April's over here eating and Oliver's getting tired. Um, you can actually both head home. I think I'm gonna actually end this part here guys. I know it hasn't been very long but I have quite a bit to do today. I have loads of uni work that I have to do and also the Olympics are on and I've been addicted to it. The ice hockey was on and I love ice hockey so yeah I'm gonna get back to watching that. I hope you all enjoyed this part. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Really means a lot to me. Um, I recently reached 500 subscribers, which is a big amount of people to me. And I have a 500 subscribers giveaway going on at the minute, which finishes next Friday. So I will link that in the description below and you can all feel free to enter that if you are subscribed to me because I do want to give back to you guys and it's just a thank you to say thanks for being interested in my videos and I'm really glad you seem to be liking what I put up. I've had so much fun on this channel, it it's ch pretty much changed my life and yeah it's a lot a lot of fun and you guys make that fun for me so enough with the rambling, I will link that below, you can feel free to enter if you would like to. And yeah, once again, just thanks for everything you guys do for me. Uh, leave your comments below of what you want to see out of this LP. And yeah, I will reply and stuff like that. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye!